Buenas noches, señoras y señores, ¿cómo están? Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Voy a tener el placer de presentarle a una persona que va a hablar y va a presentar a esa persona, el, la el siguiente persona que va a ser miembro del de North Carolina Soccer Hall of Fame. La persona que va a ser un miembro, no estoy seguro cómo se dice hall en español, pero vamos a decir cuarto, ¿ok? <risa> cuarto de, de personas famosas en Carolina del Norte para el juego de fútbol. La persona que vamos a tener aquí va a ser Tony Suárez. Él tiene un amigo. El amigo se llama Tomás de Madera Negra. I'm going to stop at that. You're wondering what in heaven's name is Madera Negra. Well, actually, what I'm, my job here is to introduce the next speaker. And I did feel that the Suarez family would enjoy a little bit uh, presenting in Spanish because their son, Tony Suarez, was born in Cuba. I happen to have grown up in Cuba. I was born in New York City and when I was five years old, we moved to Cuba in 1946, lived there for 14 years. So uh, I offered to uh, present the next speaker. The next speaker is Tom Blackwood. That's where the Madera Negra comes from. Madera is wood and Negra is, is black, Tom Blackwood. So uh, Tom um, is an attorney And please don't count that against him. Billy Joe Morgan is an attorney. And listen, the guy standing up, stood up several times, and you applauded him every time. He's gotten up, so attorneys must be good people, presumably. Um, but Tom was a friend of uh, Tony Suarez. Tony was a fellow that uh, we all know did inspire young people um, with his involvement in the game of soccer. His story inspires as much as anything. And being a friend at that time of the young fellow from Cuba, Tony Suarez, must have been an exciting kind of experience. A little bit about Tom Blackwood that I learned this evening is, is that he went to Davidson College and uh, had a current member of the Hall of Fame as, Tom put it, his goalkeeper, his goalkeeper. That goalkeeper happened to have been Charlie Slagle, I found out. And we just had an examination to find out whether or not Charlie is among the weird people in the world, and he passed. He apparently is not as weird as Mr. Finneyfrock. But I present to you Tom Blackwood, who in turn will speak on behalf of Tony Suarez and accept the award of member of the North Carolina Soccer Hall of Fame on his behalf. is crazy. <laughs> um, I played with Tony for a long time. In the bio you can see we won many, as a team in Charlotte, we won many championships. And the, the, the bottom line is Tony was a really, really good soccer player, naturally. And it was, it was just after our Davidson experience, it was amazing to, to know that if he showed up, we were going to win. And it was true, he would always get the goal. The Carolina Lightning figured that out later on. Um, but Tony wasn't always uh, at the level he ended up at. Uh, I think when I played against him at Davidson, he was a defender. And I started thinking about this a couple of days ago when I realized I would have to do this, <laughs> that um, there was this guy at Appalachian, some of you may remember him, <clears throat> his name was Thompson Usiyan. So Tony's at, uh, at Appalachian and this Nigerian international shows up who was a very, very good person. And Tony always told me that's where I learned everything was from this guy Thompson. So a couple of days ago, I just did an internet search, uh, found his Facebook page and emailed Thompson about uh, one, Tony's passing away, and two, that he was being inducted. And uh, within four hours, I had a reply. And he, of course, he was a little upset about hearing about 
uh, uh, Tony not being alive anymore, but he wrote, I have fond memories of our days at Appalachian State University in Boone, North Carolina. His greatest attributes to ASU soccer program was his love for the game. He liked and was loved by all the players and coaches. On the field, he was relentless and determined to prove us wrong of his skills. He will be greatly missed by ASU soccer alumni. <clears throat> Congratulations to him, his family, and friends on his induction into the North Carolina Soccer Hall of Fame. If he were here today, he would be proud of his contributions and his accomplishments to soccer in general. And frankly, I think that um, if Tony was here, uh, I, I did write down a few days ago that uh, if he were alive, he would have been uh, eight months ago before the Carolina Lightning reunion, he would have been drifting in the nostalgia of a, for, a forgotten career. All his friends knew about it, but you know, you know how it is. Um, I have a feeling that if he was standing before you all right now, that he wouldn't be able to talk. I mean, this is just amazing. And uh, he would just be in tears. Um, I'm sure that he would want to thank everyone he played with. He'd want to thank his family. He would really love to thank his Carolina Lightning teammates, because it, it was an incredible family back then. And uh, in closing, I think, uh, on behalf of Tony Suarez, I would like to uh, thank the North Carolina Soccer Hall of Fame for its magnanimous but deserved award. That's it.